Hi and welcome to NET Vapor Reviews. Today's review is the last liquid from Drake's Tobacco Fusion. I kept it to last because it's to do with coffee. I am not a huge fan of coffee, e-liquids. I love drinking coffee. The nearest one that I enjoy very much now, sometimes in the morning, sometimes in the afternoon, evenings when I have a strong coffee, is a liquid that I reviewed either before this review or after, and it's from the Sabores del Enchanto Coffee and Milk. That was a very nice coffee e-liquid, and you can watch my review on it. Today, this is a naturally extracted tobacco coffee liquid. So let me read you what it says on the website, drakesliquid.com, and it's called Sal... Cal Salikos Coffee Tobacco E-Liquid. You can see the bottle and you can see what it's named. It's very small, but it's called Cal Salikos Coffee. Yep, naturally extracted tobacco. Um, it's named after some English pirates. Um, you can read about him a bit more on the website. And his real name was John Rackham. Right. Now, the taste that's most interesting to us, they describe it as made, uh, the flavor profile is made with uh, Amazonian tobacco from Peru, combined with a naturally extracted Peruvian coffee. Okay, and flavor, uh, Amazonian tobacco gives a spicy yet savory taste with a unique undertone blended with rich, naturally extracted Peruvian coffee. 60 VG, 40 PG. Sounds very good, <laughs> I must say. Um, so we'll taste it. I kept it to last because of the coffee element in it. I blended this to 9 milligrams of nicotine by adding um, 6.4 mil of 72 milligrams strength nicotine. Let's smell this. Mm. Yes, you can taste the smell the coffee. Oh, it's, it's... You know what? These you can open very easy, and I've seen them now on other liquids as well, I'm, I'm happy to say. Amazonian tobacco. Well, it sounds, it smells very good. Let's see how it how it vapes. Right, so I rewicked my mouth along R Amit's mouth along RDA, and let's try it. So far, the Drakes have produced. Trim Tremendous liquids on the fusion range. I vape them now quite often, especially the apple, the maple, the uh, peppermint, and the whiskey. A bit less often the whiskey. The least often is the cherry that I vape normally in the mornings. Not all day vapes, all the rest are all day vapes. Right. Let's try this one. I think I spell it right by saying Salikos coffee. Let's go. Quite a throat throat uh, got hit from this. Oh, I cannot vape this direct along. This is very strong. This is a very interesting liquid. Because the coffee is a very roasted, um, nearly smoky flavor, it's taking me a minute to taste the tobacco.
You see, the coffee flavor and the tobacco blend so well, you don't know immediately which is the tobacco and which is the coffee. I need some more juice. Let's add some more juice. It's a very, it's a unique flavor. I mean, I, all the rest of tobacco fusion, you taste straight away the tobacco and the added fruity note, the maple, the apple, the whiskey, uh, the cherry, whatever it is. This is a bit more, uh, needs a bit more thought. Well, you can definitely taste the tobacco, but it's blended so well in the coffee. It's definitely a roasted, rich coffee flavor. Very authentic, very authentic. And the tobacco is as well a very, it gives a spicy, spicy, a bit of smoky note to it. See, I don't know if the smokiness is coming from the coffee or from the tobacco. One minute. <clears throat> this is not one of those straightforward liquids they can describe immediately this takes a bit of analyzing now let's try it wide open yeah the coffee is a very authentic well it's naturally extracted <coughs> it's quite strong i must tell you i think you should reduce the nicotine on this one this is a nine and i find it fairly strong um the coffee is a rich and full-bodied coffee you can actually taste it and the tobacco is as well a spicy tobacco. So the spiciness of the tobacco with the roastiness of the coffee is a strong e-liquid. Good stuff. Definitely, it's very nice. It's just I'm trying to get my head round to try and I'm just adding a bit more juice to separate the liquids. The flavoring it's very master masterfully blended, so it all come in the excellent inhale, more or less the same profile. First of all, I'm happy to say that the coffee is, is not overwhelming. So if you're not crazy on coffee vapes, this is not your classic coffee. This is more of a tobacco with blended in a very rich, like a roasted bean type of coffee, very nice coffee flavor. And there's a bit of sweetness to it. It's nice tobacco. It's a nice liquid indeed. I can see myself vaping this a whole day. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Um, it is a very strong tobacco. It's a very strong e-liquid. 
So for instance, first thing in the morning, this will do very well. Another thing I will tell you, I do a lot of jogging. When I finish jogging, say an hour at least I do a few times a week, um, we've got a group of joggers, runners, we go down not far from where I live, we've got a beautiful river. After the, after the exercise and after a good warm shower, you need a strong e-liquid strong tobacco e-liquid. So I normally vape my naturally extracted tobaccos, the pure, bolded, bold tobaccos that I reviewed on my channel. You can see those. This one, I think, will be the right liquid for that moment. Yes. It's got a kick to it. It's full-bodied. It's not like the Caesar cherry. The Caesar cherry was a Latikia, smoky, full-bodied tobacco. And the cherry, the, it was set, the flavor of cherry was um, in, within the tobacco, but, but a bit separate. This, the coffee and the, and the tobacco are blended together. So you don't taste tobacco and then coffee. You're tasting the tobacco and the coffee in one go. And each, each of them masks a bit the other. So what you get is, is a very nice tobacco vape with a coffee undertone. So the smokiness, the spiciness of the tobacco with the roastiness of the, of the coffee is one 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 vape one flavor profile I told you it's more of a complex straight away i noticed it's more of a complex e-liquid let me have another drink <clears throat> yeah you can taste the coffee and the tobacco together. It's a delightful vape, but I must tell you, it is a strong vape. It is a strong e-liquid. And if you, for instance, go on a 12, I, I recommend you reduce it a bit. Anything you normally vape on, reduce a bit because this is a very strong liquid. You could always add later. I'm going to go on vaping this for a while, see how I get on with it as an all-day vape, but I doubt very much I could be able to vape this all day long. But the more I'm vaping it now, I'm in 13 minutes now, and I am already getting accustomed to the power of the liquid. And yeah, and I'm also getting used to, to the flavor, so perhaps I will be able to vape this longer than I thought I would. It's a very nice liquid, and this is a fitting end to the range of tobacco fusion from Drake's. They've done a marvelous job, I must tell you, on the whole range. This is, I think I'm spelling it correctly, Salikos. I can't think of any other way to spell it. Salikos Coffee Tobacco Liquid. The first, when you hear the name, you think it's a coffee. It's, it is a coffee. You can taste the coffee. But the tobacco and the coffee come together very well. Oh, yeah. I think I can get, I, I can vape this longer than I thought I would. Okay, we'll see how we get on. All right. Thank you for watching. Take care. Enjoy your vape. Until the next review. Bye-bye for now.